The recruit is fully turned out in protective clothing and seated and belted on the fire apparatus. Radio is placed in the front pocket of the jacket. The recruit will wait for the apparatus to come to a complete stop before dismounting. The recruit will look and verbalize looking both ways before stepping off the apparatus. The recruit will grab the plug wrench with their right hand and undo the pack strap with their left hand. The recruit will unbuckle the seatbelt on the humat valve with their left hand. Then take both the plug wrench and humat valve in their right hand and take the supply line in their free hand. The recruit will then pivot to their right so the hose is over their left shoulder and move away from the truck ensuring not to make any backward steps. The recruit will take enough hose to reach seven strides past the plug. The recruit will pivot towards the plug and proceed to take two strides past the plug. The recruit squats with the humat in front of them facing the plug with the plug wrench in hand. At that point the recruit will physically and verbally signal the engineer to go. After the first coupling has dropped from the hose bed, the recruit will take the humat in the right hand, move toward the hydrant, and correctly flip the hose over the hydrant, placing the humat out of the work area. The recruit will break the steamer cap with the wrench and place the wrench on the hydrant stem. The recruit will remove the steamer cap and place the humat valve on the exposed steamer threads. The recruit will stand behind the hydrant checking the humat valve is closed and the hose clamp is secure, in place, and verbalizes or signals water is flowing. The recruit must open the hydrant completely. Water must get to the clamp within 1 minute and 15 seconds. Looking for kinks! The recruit must straighten kinks near the hydrant. The recruit will take the hydrant wrench and follow supply line to the apparatus. The recruit will place the hydrant wrench on the back of the apparatus and don their SCBA. The recruit must close the compartment door after. The recruit will grab the appropriate tool as instructor selects, close the compartment door, and proceed to the fire. The recruit will be ready to work and function in an IDLH environment with all protective clothing correctly on, SCBA bottle fully open and strap secure, no skin exposure or air leaks, radio in the jacket breast pocket, all tasks and critical factors must be completed within the 3 minute and 40 second timeline.